still get udon as my first meal because I haven't had anything and I've been craving udon for a while now. I forgot to mention that I went to Little Pebbles to get some dessert afterwards. I ordered a strawberry shortcake and a strawberry croissant. Oh my god, my face is so red. I can't tell if I like that place, the Little Pebbles, but it's okay, I guess. one yet it's actually the next day and i haven't filmed anything since yesterday so today i'm just going to show you what i bought yesterday and the few things that i bought over the past few days and please don't mind my hair it's my ponytail and it's very messy and not the best <laughs> i'm just gonna put my hair now i think it looks better this way so i'm just gonna show you all the books that i got from the past few days and i got a lot honestly so the first book that I got is the Love on the Brain. Another book I got is Love in Other Words. Another book that I got is the Mind Killer Vacation. The Hating Game. Set on You. Malibu Rising. And last but not least is Veredity, which I'm, this is the book I'm most excited to read. But I have so many other books that are on my shelf that I need to be, that need to be read. But I think I'm going to read this one first. Okay, so now I'm going to show you the Korean skincare that I bought. And the place that I buy my Korean skincare is from Sukoshi, where they have like tons of K-beauty brands that are pretty popular. So the first thing I got is the Isn't Trade Green Tea Brush Toner. This is my favorite toner of all time. Next is the XSY Heart Leaf Mind Type Common Cream. Another moisturizer that I bought is the Purito um, Rebarrier Cream with Pamphanol. And this is the Beauty of Jepson, um Sunscreen. I heard a lot of good things about this type of sunscreen. And the last thing is the Rovectin, Rovectin cleanser. This is my favorite type of cleanser, and this is the only type of cleanser I'll ever use. It's actually been a few hours since I last filmed. I just want to recap up on my solo day I did yesterday. And please don't mind my skin being red right now. It's just a little sensitive. So I didn't plan on um, doing another solo day from yesterday because I thought I would go home after I bought my skincare. But at the time, I was just wanting some food, and I went to the udon place. And that udon place is the best spot to have a solo date by yourself. And I wasn't being awkward or anything. It was really comfortable. I was kind of comfortable, and the food was great, obviously. And as far as me filming myself in public, I still get awkward and uncomfortable sometimes because I'm not sure if people are staring at me and and normally I don't know what to say when I'm feeling when I'm filming myself in public. Overall was this the solo day yesterday was better than the one I did on Friday and yeah. <laughs> and I'm not sure if I'll edit the um solo day I did on Friday because I'm not proud of that and you can see I was very awkward, but maybe I'll uh, edit it. <laughs> 